Hi guys, welcome back to another video of HTML Camp. In this video, we will be creating a copy to clipboard system using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. If you want to know how this was made, make sure you stay to the end. Also, consider subscribing and leaving a like on this video, it really helps a lot. Enough talking, let's start coding. I have gone ahead and created an HTML and CSS script. I will link my HTML and CSS scripts with the link tag. In the body tag, create a dev with the class of copy field. In it create a span tag with the ID of link. In the span tag, paste the link you want to be copied. Create another span tag and give it the ID of copy btn. Set the text to copy. I'll open the website with the VS Code Live Server extension. In the style sheet, using the universal selector, set the padding and margin to zero. Set the box sizing to border box and the font family to quicksand. For the body tag, set the width to 100%, the height to 100VH, the display to flex, align items to center and justify content to center. This will center the content in the web page. With the copy field tag, set the display to flex, align item to center, background color to hashtag 212121 and border radius to 5 pixels. Style the link tag with a width of 350 pixels and padding of 12 pixels by 10 pixels. Give it a border of 1 pixel and set the color to hashtag 212121. Set the background color to white, border radius to 5 pixels and font size to 19 pixels. Set the overflow X to scroll. Preview your website. Set the display of the scroll bar to none. Now you see that the scroll bar is gone. Give the copy BTN a color of white, padding of 20 pixels to the left and right, a font size of 18 pixels, and set the cursor to pointer. Now, let's add the copy action with some simple JavaScript. In the HTML document, create a script tag. In it create a variable called copy btn. Set it equal to document.getElementById. Set the ID to copy btn. Create another variable called link and also set it to document.getElementById. Set the ID to link. Create an onClick event on the copy btn variable and set it equal to a function. In the function, type in navigator.clipboard.write text and set the text to link.inner html. Now the link is copied to the clipboard whenever the copy button is clicked. Back in the HTML script, in the onclick function, set copy btn.inner html to copied. Create a set timeout function and set the timeout to 2000 milliseconds. Create a function to be called after the timeout and in it, set copy btn.inner html to copy. Now, when the button is pressed it becomes copied and goes back to copy after 2 seconds. I hope this video was helpful and please consider subscribing to the channel and leaving a like on this video. See you in the next video.